Even though this man has lived in Florida for the past 18 years, it's not surprising to see him with a sketch pad on a wall in downtown Maysville. People walk by, they'll think I'm drawing the historical structures and stuff. No, I'm drawing cartoons and witches and bats and pumpkins and anything magical and fun. It's something Sean McHugh did from the time he was nine years old, when these brick-covered streets were his whole world. In a city this old, incorporated in 1787, there's a lot to stoke the imagination. This place is so haunted. There's a haunted hospital, there's a haunted theater, there's a haunted mansion right over here. Sean has found a way to combine his love of Halloween and cartooning. He has collaborated with his niece, Katie Parker. She writes the words, he provides the illustrations for a series of children's books called Broomsticks, about young witches who use their powers for good. I always wanted to marry Elizabeth Montgomery and I wanted to be Charles Schultz. Sean now has his dream job as a caricature artist at Walt Disney World, but he's back in his hometown often. This week, bringing a new Broomsticks book once upon a Maysville moon, the first one that's a full color picture book. Sean calls his latest work a love letter to Maysville. A walk through downtown will take you past many places pictured in the book. Tall steeples, prominent bridges, pretty fountains, the things tourists notice and locals sometimes take for granted. Even you know at nine, I was hoping I would be doing this. Sean and Katie even found the perfect place for a Halloween book signing, a pioneer graveyard behind a museum. One is to Sunny. The venue, like the book, fascinating, not frightening. I have nothing against the horror stuff, but I always went for the cute stuff. I like jack-o'-lanterns. I love It's the Great Pumpkin, Charlie Brown. I love Bewitched. I love anything that's fun and magical. Once people read them, they'll share them with friends out of the country, and then they'll come and visit Maysville. The pair will likely conjure up more adventures for their young witches. Yes, we, we decided that if this one goes well, we've already got some things on the back burner. Small towns do have a charm about them, and a native of this one hopes to put a few more people under its spell with his magic markers. It feels like I'm a little kid again, but I'm a little kid that gets to have book signings. In Maysville, Marvin Bartlett with the spirit of the bluegrass.